Lyman throws the ball up to the Dolman. Four. Mm -mm. Inside Into Chris, Chris Brown. Brown. Ball knocked away the and the harm. Oh, sorry about that. <laughs> That's Sean Cook, ladies and gentlemen. He loves being on TV so bad. He's going to stand up in front of the camera any chance he can get. <laughs> Welcome to Hawk Sportsnet. Action. And next on CSM TV, college baseball. That's right, watch as your CSM Hawks take on the Germantown Griffins. Live on tape from Regency Furniture Stadium. One more time. Watch as a moron stands swinging a bat. He doesn't know that we got it right the first time, and now we're just going to make fun of him as he points with his right hand. Now he will switch and point with his left hand. Look how moronic he can be. Now both hands up in the air, like he's being knocked over by a bunch of foul balls. Now he's standing there like an idiot, waiting to hit himself in the head with the bat. Watch as he walks off, unaware that he's still on camera. All right, we got it. Thank you, that was good. Right. <laughs> it's the blooper reel, folks. Just laugh. It's going to be funny. Hello, everyone, and welcome to Regency Furniture Stadium. In just a few mo... Ah! <laughs> Stinking name. Blanford? No, me, Josh McGee. <laughs> this is what they're saying in the huddle. Okay, guys, I know I screwed up, but, you know, we should, like, try to put the ball in the hoop and at the things of that nature. Okay. And um, Josh takes over for um, Eric. Look at Josh get down. Look at his moves. are all wearing pink <laughs> are all wearing pink shirts this is the first game of four games against Germantown two at home and two away <laughs> our basic game plan is to play our hawk volleyball our, our volleyball they're hawks too by them it's to play volleyball the way we know how to play volleyball and not so much look into what they're doing, but just keep our game plan, keep, keep our... Are you laughing at me? No, there was a girl that wanted to get by and she saw you doing the interview, so she rolled on the floor. Oh. Um, to, you know, play the way we know oh, how to... You can't, you gotta edit that. You can start that again. Start that again. You can't laugh. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. She rolled like she was in the yeah. army going across a landmine. I... Alright. Ready? Be nervous. I'm gonna be, uh, yeah, you can look in an air, you can look at me. I mean, I'm very attractive, you can look at me, I understand that, but I am married, so you gotta, you know, there'll be no, like, weekend romance. Welcome back to Regency Furniture Center. I'm here with Josh Harris, as always, and Coach Bladford. And that's Josh uh, McGee. <laughs> Sean, what should we do next? I mean, what, what do you, I mean, what do you think? I'll let you drive the show now. Well, no, we're gonna talk to another player from, returning player from last year, because. That's right, that's what we're gonna do. That's exactly what we're gonna do, because the idea is here. We want to give you guys a look at kind of where we've been and where we're going. But, Sean, I didn't talk to any more returning players. No, I did. Oh! <laughs> you showed up before the game? <laughs> Inside joke, ladies. And not even, you know, just five uh, minutes before. Inside, Sean believes magic elves. All right, Sean, who, okay. did you, who did you talk to? I talked to Byron Morgan. Outstanding. That's the interview I have, so let's go to that. Okay, well, uh, well, uh, you want me to tee it up, or are you going to just go right there? Well, I mean, it's your show. Byron Morgan, returning player. Uh, and you know he had a, a huge injury last year. Huge. <laughs> that was like a trick. That was really like a train wreck. We're gonna do that again. You think? I was like, what do you think? What do you think? I don't know. What are we doing? I don't know. Sure. What say you, Dan? What was that other guy's name? Colby. <laughs> Travels by not moving his feet, so I guess it's on both sides of the court. And a good call by the ref. Mm -mm. Well, deflected. Each other. 
Like you're gonna get fouled. Hey, buddy. <laughs> you give me gas like Tim Bowie. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Josh, there are no injuries for tonight, but, um, what else do I talk about? <laughs> Welcome back, everyone, to Regency Furniture Stadium as the CSM TV Hawks. Oh. Uh, final score here, 66-44. Lady Hawks fall to the Harford Fighting Owls. Uh, as, as always, Dan O'Connell here with, uh, for one night and one night only, Sean Cook. Hey. Thanks for being with it's us. It's been great. It's been great. Uh, well, well. Uh, <laughs> it just relaxed like we are. Oh. Outstanding. That's a strike. Over the plate. We are at a baseball field. We're calling time right now based on the skunk. I believe we're going to wait the skunk out. The skunk is foul right now. <laughs> well, the skunk is always foul. <laughs> but soon the skunk will be fair if he crosses that line. Oh. Well, well. Uh, uh, <laughs> Thank you. No. This is like thinking the Steelers are going to win the Super Bowl. It's foolhardy. It's foolhardy. <laughs> a man and a skunk. The space in the outfield was only big enough for one of them. Who will prevail? The umpire stood with his clicker, counting balls and strikes. He looked to his right and huck, a skunk in foul territory. The skunk made his way onto the field of play, time was called, and we ended up here with a standoff. <laughs> And ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. The best you ever sounded. <laughs> what will happen now? Will the skunk yield? Or will the man yield? Mm -hmm. Will we play the game with a skunk in the outfield, ever to be determined as a stinky game? Or will this foolish man walk out with a trash can and get sprayed in the face with some skunk? What's the stupidest thing you did today on your Saturday, Bill? Well, I went out and tried to catch a skunk in a trash can. <laughs> Are you serious, Chuck? Yes, yes I am. Why would you do that? I don't know. It was a bet. Brings the ball up, drops it off, comes down to Saquon Brown, who drops Ooh! it off. Ooh! Right on Ooh! the big man! Oh! We're getting up for that, baby! Whoa! That's up some Hey, what's up with that? Meaning what? Where are you? Why Josh have a close-up camera? Why don't I have a close-up? Right here. It's not a close-up. It's a far back. She's got a close-up. Oh, I guess it is kind of close. Yeah, you're the president. Give us more money. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Josh. There are no injuries for tonight, but as you can see behind me, there we're celebrating breast cancer awareness. All the players and the coaches are all are all wearing pink shirts. There's always an injury tonight because I just saw a ball fly by. <laughs> I'm letting the coach have it. Can't break a press? Come on, man. I just break a press when I was 12 and under. He gives a trash can to the umpire. The umpire comes in with the trash can, attempting to scoop up the skunk. The skunk clearly does not want to be in the trash can as he is motoring towards the foul line. The umpire takes one more step. The skunk, another crawl. A crawl out to the foul line, perhaps. So if you've tuned in late, the game isn't far in just a couple of minutes uh, but you can always catch up on it again at another time by logging on to our website at www.csmd.edu uh, excuse me www.csmd.edu slash csm tv i always have trouble with that uh, website address oh it's awful <laughs> <laughs> until you log on and then it's a pretty nice website yeah, what you, you say log on, it's